everybody. I'm Matt Stone. And I'm Trey Parker. And this here is Macon. Say hi, old fella. <laughs> We're back to show you the versatility and nutrition of one of nature's perfect foods. Bacon! Yeah! That's right, today we're gonna make French bacon sandwiches. How does that sound? Let's start by cooking the bacon. Butter, bacon, salt. Ooh, doesn't that smell good, Macon? Well, while we're waiting for our bacon to cook, let's watch our favorite episode of South Park. It's called Flashbacks. It's all about the kids getting stuck on the school bus and their driver, Miss Crabtree, falling in love. Flashback episodes are what you do when you're near the end of a season and you're fresh out of new ideas. <laughs> Hey, you ready for some bacon, Macon? Macon loves bacon. Come on, guy. You want it? You want it? You want it? Yeah, that's a buddy. Need more bacon. Need more bacon. Yeah. So sit back, relax, and enjoy flashbacks. And when we return, French bacon sandwiches. <laughs> Wow, what a great episode. And look, Trey, our bacon is cooked just right. Not too soggy, not too crisp. Well, I've got the bread and French dressing all prepared. So we remove the bacon, like so. Then we cover sparingly with French dressing, put on the other slice of bread, and garnish. Doesn't that look great? Mmm, mmm. Hey, let's get some of the bacon. Mm -hmm. Macon likes his with extra bacon. <laughs> there you go, buddy. Yeah. Wow. Macon's really taken to the bacon, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> well, now it's time to watch our favorite episode of South Park. It's called Summer Sucks. That's right. It's all about that one week in the year when summer actually comes to South Park and all the snow melts. This episode has a special guest appearance by Jonathan Katz of Dr. Katz Professional Therapist. Well, sit back, relax, and enjoy Summer Snacks. Hello, everyone. I'm Matt Stone. And I'm Trey Parker. And we're Cooking Bacon. And here to help us is our old pal, Macon. Say hi, Macon. Well, today's dish is called Northern Wyoming Bacon Loaf. Sounds good, huh? To make it, you will need three pounds of cooked bacon, two eggs, one cup of cheese soup, and another pound of cooked bacon. We've already started cooking the bacon. Ooh, smell that bacon. Mm, bacon's going crazy. All right, hold on, hold on. Macon loves bacon. Come on, guy. You want it? You want it? You want it? Yeah, that's a buddy. And more bacon. Yeah. Now, once the bacon is cooked, we're ready for the food processor. That's right. We're going to put all the ingredients in the food processor. Get this grease off here. Mm -hmm. Get the eggs, more bacon, more bacon, and mix. Whoa, bacon. Want some more bacon? <laughs> While we're waiting for that, let's watch our favorite episode of South Park. It's called Chef's Chocolate Salty Balls. That's right. You see, Matt and I have been several times to the Sundance Film Festival in Utah, and we think it totally sucks ass. So we decided to have Robert Redford bring his little festival to South Park. <laughs> Apparently Mr. Redford doesn't like us too much because of this episode. Maybe that's because we have him drowning in shit. Well, who cares? He's old. Now, I'm going to put this dish in the oven at 450 degrees. You all sit back, relax, and enjoy Chef's Chocolate Salty Balls. And when we return, Northern Wyoming Bacon Loaf. What a great episode. Yep, and we're back just in time to check up on our Northern Wyoming Bacon Loaf. Say, that looks baconlicious. <laughs> now all we have to do is garnish. Hey, Macon's going crazy. Hold on, buddy, this one's for you. Okay. Here's a nice, fresh bacon loaf just for making. Whoa, hold on there, buddy. Not too fast now. Okay, all right, hey. Well, all that bacon grease can't go to waste. So what I do is I pour it into ice pot makers, like this. That's right, you see, bacon grease congeals. So if you pour it in and you wait long enough, bacon pops. Who'd like to try one? You, come on up. Come over here, you. Do you like bacon? Yeah. Well, give that a try. How is it? It's bacon-licious. 
Well, now it's time to watch our favorite episode of South Park. It's called Chicken Pox. You see, Chicken Pox affects you worse the older you get. So when I was young, my mom would make me sleep over at friends' houses when they had Chicken Pox in hopes that I would get the dreaded disease while I was still a child. Well, in this episode, the boys also learn a valuable lesson when they hire a prostitute with cold sores to give their parents herpes. So grab a bacon pop, sit back, and enjoy Chicken Pox. Hello, everyone. I'm Trey Parker. And I'm Matt Stone, and we're doing what we do best. Bacon, bacon with bacon! That's right. And here to help us is our old buddy, Macon. <laughs> Nobody likes bacon, bacon more than Macon. That's true. If someone's bacon, bacon, Macon's heart starts breaking if he's forsaken. Well, today we're going to make a bacon dish that you kids can all make at home. Western Iowa bacon casserole. Mm. First off, let's cook the bacon. Butter. Bacon. Salt. Mmm, that smells good. You like that, Macon? Mm. You better give Macon his treat. Oh, right. Now, what we've done for Macon is we've taken some bacon and we've wrapped it around some pork sausages. This is one of Macon's favorite treats. All right, buddy, here you go, here you go. Yeah. Come on, come on. Once the bacon is done, we chop it up and then get a casserole dish where we add our other ingredients. That's right. Frozen hash browns on the bottom, bacon in the middle, some processed cheese item, more bacon, more bacon. And then we're going to top it all off with bacon. Ah. Now we're going to bake this for 30 minutes at 450 degrees. And while we're waiting, let's watch our favorite episode of South Park. It's all about the boys' haunting trip to the planetarium and Cartman's quest to be a star. That's right. You know, most people don't know it, but this episode is actually a parody of an old Star Trek episode called Dagger of the Mind. <laughs> and so that's why we decided to call this episode Roger Ebert Should Eat Less Fatty Foods. <laughs> Enjoy the show, and we'll be back with Western Idaho Bacon Casserole. Wow, what a great episode. And what great timing. Our Western Idaho Bacon Casserole is ready. Wow, that looks bacon-licious. Now all we have to do is dish it out and garnish with a side of bacon. Oh, Macon feels left out. He needs some bacon. All right. Who loves bacon? 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 Who, who loves bacon? <laughs> now, we can't let all this bacon grease go to waste. So this time, we're going to pour it into a mold, and that makes a fabulous dessert. Well, now it's time for our favorite episode of South Park. It's called Clubhouses. This is about that innocent time in every kid's life where they play Truth or Dare for the first time. The first time I played Truth or Dare was with my Uncle Steve. Well, this episode is also about the nasty business of divorce. Divorce is a terrible thing. Both Matt's parents and my parents are still married. And that's the main reason we turned out to be such nice guys. Have some more bacon, pig. So now we're going to enjoy some Western Idaho bacon casserole, and you all enjoy clubhouses. houses.